I worked with the US Antarctic program on Mount Erebus in Antarctica. Mm. Uh, I went there for 13 field seasons, and that was the time of my life going down to, to that volcano. It's, it's um, on Ross Island. So, so we go to New Zealand, we fly south, uh, uh, reach McMurdo Station, biggest scientific base in Antarctica, and, and Erebus is, is uh, pretty close to the station. So very good logistics. Typically, actually, we uh, get there around Thanksgiving, hang out until Christmas, come back down, spend about a month in the field camp uh, on the volcano. Scientifically, it was very rewarding. We, it, it has a, lava, a perpetual lava lake. So you go up to the crater, um, peer in, and about 300 meters down is, is this la lava lake. I mean, it's, it's minus 30 Celsius, um, you know, behind you. So, but you, it's, you're not close enough to, to kind of feel the toasty warmth of this thing. But we, yeah, we, we saw some, yeah, very extraordinary phenomena at this volcano. So I, I loved that, but I, I just love the, it, it, it was just a sensational place to live. We're in, we're in tents. It's 24 hour daylight. Um, we're at altitude. The air is thin. It is, it is cold. Uh, the weather can be severe. Um, and there'd be maybe 10 of us. So we were a little community, um, living together, working together, uh, fixing things, holding up when there's a blizzard and, and uh, entertaining ourselves in, in the, the field camp. 